The U.S. had their first World Cup match last night against Ghana. They ended up winning 2-1. to one. Um, The U.S. got on the board quick with a, a great goal by Clint Dempsey. 34 seconds into the match, it's the fastest uh, U.S. goal in the World Cup. An unbelievable finish from Dempsey and a, and a great way to start the World Cup uh, for the U.S. Um, 23 minutes into the match, Josie Altidore went down with a hamstring injury. Um, that's going to have a huge impact on, on the U.S. going forward. It would be a great time to be able to insert Landon Donovan, unfortunately, because uh, he's not on the roster. Uh, he won't be able to play. So the U.S. is going to have to figure who to pair up top with Dempsey as well, um, maybe making some formation changes uh, in these next two group stage games. Um, Jonathan Brooks in the, uh, in the 83rd minute was able to uh, give us the go-ahead goal. Um, off of a set piece from Graham Zusi off of a corner, he scores with a, a header. Jonathan Brooks was um, possibly not even going to make the World Cup roster. He's only got five international caps and uh, he's 21 years of age and scores a goal to, uh, to give the U.S. Uh, our first World Cup win. Um, some of the keys to the, to the game for us were, one, getting that early goal. Uh, Dempsey really set the tone for us. It was great because the, most of the game we were defending and, and trying to chase Ghana, um, which had a lot of uh, the guys fatigued defending that long and, and had some injury problems. Also, uh, you know, Matt Beasler going out at the half uh, forced us to make some substitutions that we generally wouldn't have made at, at that point in the game. Um, but an overall uh, great win for the U.S. Next up, we play Portugal Sunday night, uh, the 22nd at 6 p.m. Uh, Portugal had a disappointing loss to Germany uh, in their first game, so they're going to be coming back uh, really looking to, to make a statement, especially Cristiano Ronaldo, one of the greatest players in the world, um, is really going to, to try and uh, get at the U.S. with maybe a, a different pairing in the back line uh, for us. So. Some of the keys for us in that game are one, to, uh, to be able to attack. We need to be able to keep the ball a little bit better to relieve some of that pressure uh, defensively. And then two, defensively we've got to be solid with our back line uh, matching up against Ronaldo and Nani is going to be a, a really tough test for us. Um, we've got to be able to, to find the goal somehow. Um, Pepe, one of the, the center backs for Portugal, will be out for this game. He received a red card against uh, Germany. So that's big for us. Maybe we can try and take advantage of uh, him being out as well as some of the other injuries that they may have.